Um, Dr. Zakir, we have a question here from a Christian brother. He says, I would like to know what you have in Islam that is different from us Christians. Uh, as far as Islam is concerned, is people have a misconception that Islam is the new religion which came into existence 14 years back. And Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, was the founder of the religion of Islam. In fact, Islam is there since time immemorial, since man set foot on the earth. Yes. And Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam yes. is not the founder, but he is the last and final messenger of Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. So in Islam, we have to believe in all the messengers that have to be believed uh, by the Christians, right from Adam, uh, Moses, uh, Noah, Abraham, Jesus, peace be upon them all. But what we say, that we also believe in another last and final messenger, that is Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. So yeah. we tell them we have to believe in additional messenger, last and final Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And he was even prescribed in the Bible. If you read the Bible, Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, said, it's mentioned in the Gospel of John, chapter number 16, verse number 12 to 14. Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, says that I have many things to say unto you, but he cannot bear them now. For he, when the Spirit of truth shall come, he shall guide you unto all truth. He shall not speak of himself. All that he hear shall he speak. He shall glorify me. So here, Prophet Jesus says, that he had many things that he wanted to tell to his followers. Yes. But he knew that they could not grasp them now. So he says there is another messenger to come, and his name is Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And he will tell you and guide you to all truth. So we believe that whatever Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, said, we believe he was one of the mightiest messengers of God, we believe that he was born miraculously, we believe that he was the Messiah, we believe that he gave life to the dead with God's permission, we believe that he healed those born blind lepers with God's permission, but we do not believe that he is Almighty God, which yes. many of the Christians they yes. consider that Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he is God and he claimed divinity. Okay. In fact, there is not a single unequivocal statement in the complete Bible where Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, himself says that I am God or he says worship me. So the major difference is we don't consider Jesus to be God, but we consider him to be one of the mightiest messengers of God.